it's your girl, Google Fashion and Style, and I'm back today with a DIY. Um, I've been seeing these uh, Glam Vanity trays, and so I wanted to implement my own version, and because um, I just need something to put all my like jewelry and trinkets that I just throw in my dresser. And so all the items that I purchased for this project, I purchased at the Dollar Tree. So what I have for you here today to do this project is three eight by ten um, photo frames. They are silver because that is uh, the glam look I'm going for. Um, if you can't find the silver ones, I'm sure you can, but if you can't, you can just get any color and then get you some uh, silver metallic spray paint and just spray paint the frames, but I'm not going to be using that today. That's just an ideal I want to offer you. And I got one uh, mirror. It is going to be black. I'm, not, I'm sorry. It is going to be mirrored, but the uh, mirror, mirror is black, but you don't have to worry about that because I'm not using this part. I'm only going to use the mirror, and the mirror is going to be inside of the vanity tray. Now, the reason why I got three uh, photo frames is because I wanted to kind of... Uh, I want the walls to kind of be high versus the shallow, shallow look. And so I also purchased some bling wrap from the Dollar Tree. And I don't know how much of this I'm going to need, but I purchased four of them. And um, they run out of the silver kind pretty quickly. And so um, each of these are nine feet. So I also got uh, some glitter ribbon. And I'm probably going to put this inside of it because this mirror is smaller than the 8x10. So I'm going to kind of create a, uh, a, 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 I guess, a, a frame for the mirror. And it's going to look really cute. Uh, you need some glue stick. I got my glue gun. I got some china and glass cement. I also purchased this from Dollar Tree to um, glue the mirror down to uh, the frame. I also got some um, Elmer's glue wall. This is not the regular school glue. Um, that, my, that the children use, but you can use this for a lot of household repairs, craft projects, and you can use it for wood and all that, so it's not the normal school glue. And I, I have used this, you know, for, you know, small projects around the house. And uh, the last thing you're going to need is um, the legs. I'm going to use these uh, silver plastic napkin rings, and they're going to go underneath that's the legs. But I realized that um, all of the Dollar Trees may not carry these, so, uh, an alternative uh, option would be the shot glasses. Well, shot cups, they're plastic, but they're pretty sturdy. I don't drink. I just, I couldn't find these at the first Dollar Tree that I went to. And so I just picked up this 24 uh, pack of shot glasses, and I was going to use these for the legs. And you could very well take some of this bling wrap and wrap it around and just really glam it out. But it's your choice. I'm going to go with the, uh, the napkin rings. Or, you know, I may, I may use the shot but I think I got my mind pretty much set on the, uh, the these are silver plastic napkin rings that I got from the Dollar Tree. I got some scissors here to cut my uh, bling wrap when I need to. And um, yeah, that's pretty much all the items that you're going to need. And so we're just going to get right into this project. And I'm going to take this uh, first frame, base frame, and put some hot glue and so I can uh, glue the glass down. I'm gonna go back over after this project is done. I'm gonna clean the glass. So I got my glass glued in there. Now I'm just trying to play with it to see how it's gonna fit together. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna take out this mirror. Oh, it's breaking off. Good thing I'm not using it. It's just the mirror side, and as you can see, this is how it's fitting in there. So, <clears throat> I'm gonna, later on I'll probably glue the ribbon down. The ribbon will be over like that. work so so 
So I'm gonna go ahead on and glue the frames together. <clears throat> So lovelies, um, I have my frames glued together. Don't worry about the glue or the lines because the bling wrap is gonna cover it up. And um, I went ahead on and started uh, putting some bling wrap around the front of the frames. Uh, but I left this part, this one piece out, just to show y'all I did. I just cut, measured and cut, and then uh, I'm just gluing it down. And now I'm going to bling wrap the sides of it. And this is what I've pretty much been doing, just going piece by piece and just doing it in, down. Now I'm not like putting glue all in, I'm just going like skipping like maybe, a, maybe like six and then I'll put a strip of glue on the back of the little imitation stud so that, you know, a whole lot of glue isn't showing. You really can't see it anyway because it's clear. But I'm not using a whole lot of this glue. So the reason why I left a portion of the frame out, this part, uh, out, outer part of the frame is because there is a groove or a dip that's in it. And so it just lays better. But that's fine. Because most frames have that little uh, groove in them. Okay, I am making progress. I did my first script. Now, I had to, because of the scripts are so thin, I had to do uh, a second strip. So. Just slowly but surely getting it done. With glass, I'm gonna be going glass to glass. I'm gonna be working with this China glass cement I told you about earlier. And this is just for long term use. And I'm also gonna do my uh. I'm gonna hot glue it for just quick um, sticking purposes. But the uh, the glass glue is gonna make sure it's a permanent you know, stick with this glass. I get it as even as possible. This is what I have so far. Looks like it's pretty even. Now, remember the ribbon I told you about earlier, the glitter ribbon, is gonna go I am finished uh, wrapping the glam tray. <clears throat> um, I did the trim. Okay, lovelies, this is the finished result. It's completely wrapped with the bling wrap. I put the glitter border on the mirror. Um, I think it turned out great. It was a fun project. It wasn't hard. It just took a little while. But let me know if you like it. And please don't forget to, to subscribe and like.